dun 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 what is going on guys this is me bad man or a.k. blackhead man um i don't know if you like the um introduction that i made up myself but if you don't that doesn't matter because i have to do this for you for you um 12 subscribers for now um today i'm back here with another gf tutorial for you guys and what i'm gonna teach you today is um let's teach you four loops why not um let me first no don't care about it just clear my screen to get bunch of joint space and that's it um for having a uh, for loop in your uh, program or whatever it is or whatever um programming language it is for loops are kind of while loops uh they actually um do kind of in a way the same but uh, they have a little bit difference one difference um is that you have to write the syntax differently but how if you remember we uh, wrote while while something or while true not to true do this okay and in for loop actually you need three things um not just a um true statement or false statement actually um if i wanted to say uh for loop um works actually the same as while loop because the, uh, they both um check the truth okay but uh, writing a syntax for for loop is a little bit dif uh, dip, um, different so let's get in let's um declare a variable of type integer and type it for example counter equals zero and let me just uh, at first write it and then i'll explain everything clearly um counter zero and um counter come on auto suggest Yep, counter. Why are you so slow? Um, counter less than or equal, for example, 10. Um, counter plus plus. Plus plus. And then um, do, for example, uh, what should we do? Let's see how something. Why am I see outing? Why? System. System dot out dot print line and what do we want to print line print uh, for example yep print number am I typing right okay print number plus counter auto suggest that is it um and now it's time to explain everything so what i did here uh, actually doesn't matter if you declare a variable here or um, it's actually the same uh, if i write it here like this if i cut it from here and paste it in the head section and i just type here counter and then counter uh, less than or equal why is it giving me an error syntax error that's not there counter let's um yep actually i didn't put a semicolon at the end and y again yep let's declare it here for not having a problem that's actually uh, that doesn't have any difference if you write here or if you declare a variable here and use it here and initialize it here or if you just type int counter equals something um, let me just get rid of this line of code and um, the other thing about for loops um, actually you need these things or else it doesn't work 
but if I wanted to tell you um, the truth if you don't have um, the circumstance it doesn't go okay and this one um, the other thing actually you oh, how many actually I said in this tutorial shame of come on yep that's it. um the other thing about this uh, syntax about for loop syntax is this semicolon um, between two um, statements this one says uh, declare or this that declare does not matter says from this um, counter or this number whatever it is from this go to this until this uh, sentence or this statement is true uh, add one number to this number okay said so from this to this by this okay let's go from 0 to 10 until it is uh, your uh, counter is less than or equal and um, add one to your counter and that one um, you add one to your counter um, it goes or it and again comes back here uh, for example, it is if it's ten less than or equal ten. It adds one. It goes to the um, loop. It's one. It's less than or equal ten. As goes to loop and comes back again. And 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 till ten. Let's now run the app to get the result and to you one more time. Why is it not responding? I don't know why I have many problems during uh getting a result I don't know why my system bothers me come on come on that's it as you can see now come up print number one why am I resizing these columns one Print number excuse me, print number zero, print number three, four, five, six, uh, and seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, and I think you've got the point um, uh, system out print line with this uh, syntax is that I wanted to add at the end of the um, string, and um, if I wanted to. Uh, delete this zero from here and it goes from uh, 1 to 10 um, I could actually add 1 to this one and this equals 1 this is another way to uh, one number to that um, variable or plus plus or whatever it is I can get the result let's see it should go from why is it like oh actually I made a mistake because I had one here and I had, it goes by two it is zero next time it's two next time it's four and that was it um that was it and let me see if anything for now nope just one more time you need three things um, for having a for loop and what are they a four more here or that doesn't matter if you declared here at the top section did here and you say go from this number to this circumstance and until this um, statement is true go and add one to that uh, number whatever it is and execute the line of code or the lines of code let me just come here and that was it um and the reason that I didn't I uh, put the curly brackets here because um, if you have just one line of code after each line of code you don't have to put the curly brackets okay and that doesn't matter if I delete this line of code and this brand at least but you should have this semicolon at the end or else it gives you error okay that was it for today i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please do me a favor hit that subscribe button down below that i think it's here uh that badass 
um, subscribe button that is my picture i think yep that is my picture and i hope you guys enjoyed this video check out my tutorials uh, they should appear somewhere Ill, somewhere here somewhere around here and subscribe uh, i have another bu uh, subscribe button here if you enjoy and just check it out have fun catch you in the next tutorial see you then that was the outro